The world of information is ever expanding, especially the internet and online services. And ECHO gives you great tools to integrate this into your everyday work. At the top of your screen is the ECHO Shooter. Shooter lets you send information to and from Windows programs. That means you could be in a word processor or, say, on CompuServe, and just shoot information into ECHO or any other program. Let's see how. We'll switch to NetManage's Chameleon Mail program, and the shooter's still up there because it sits on top of all Windows programs. Just select a piece of information, click on Shooter, and send it into Echo. We'll send it into the calendar. Let's choose July 15 at 9 a.m. Now, let's go to Echo. And presto, there it is. You could be on the Internet, or anywhere, and just keep shooting information into Echo while you stay there. If you view the section of this video called Under the Hood, you'll see that with Echo's auto-assign, the information is automatically categorized the moment it's shot into Echo. Shooter is also great for accessing Echo's phone book when you're in another program. In a word processor, for example, click on Shooter, choose Get Address, and a client's contact details can be shot right into the letter. Now, let's tackle the Internet. It's today's hotbed of information, and Echo's got truly hot links to it. If you use NetManage's Internet Chameleon or other web browsers, such as the one used with Windows 95, just double-click on an address, and you're taken right to the home page. And if you shoot information back from the Internet, Echo stores the home page address for you in a special Internet URL address field. To help you organize the Internet, Echo includes the Internet address book with over 2,000 addresses. Select your favorites, double-click, and off you go. The first two video sections showed how Echo's powerful notepads, calendar and phone book are all the tools you need to effectively manage work and information today. For more technical details on how Echo works, let's take a look under the hood. Otherwise, just fast forward to the last color screen. 